Okay, there's been a discussion on etching samples, microscopic samples to view, and I did a little, did a little effort tonight and wasn't very surprised, but a uh, few things came out of it. Obviously, etching helps you see smaller features. I took this uh, sample that had previously been sanded and polished and reviewed and I re-sanded it with 5,000 grit paper to get a fresh start and then scanned three places across. This is the best one to look at. This is a defect that measures seven and a half thousandths across. And this is pre-etch. And you can see a few other features here, a little line there, and of course the lines down here. Here's post-etch. After I etched it, I had to sand it a little bit. Maybe I sanded it too much, but I had to get the, the dull off of it, and it was surprising how many features disappeared. And appeared. Now these little dots came in. Those little dots disappeared. I believe that this little feature, pre-etch, when we went to post-etch, uh, it's shallower. I'll probably do the sanding a little bit to the etching. This little mark here showed up as three, which would really look like a smaller, but I believe this is what this is, and then that was just under the surface, so it either got etched into or sanded away. Now, I'm generally looking for defects that are three thousandths and greater. I uh, don't think that these little bitty spots like this are really of much interest. It is interesting that there's some lines like this, which we think might be bifilm. Uh, they disappear. Some other lines appear. That's about it. Uh, nothing real conclusive other than I think I'm continuing to go, continuing to, to sand because I'm not, uh, in, in reviewing across this sample, I didn't see anything that really showed up that I didn't see before. Uh, maybe some stuff this, this size, but when you see that one disappear, then I can't say that, uh, that they showed up. They may have been a thin place eaten into, and this is a thin place eaten away by the etching. So when you get down to half a thousandth, that's less than a half a thousandth. If that's seven and a half, that's about a, a little less than a thousandth wide. So they're pretty small.